Oh shoot. Great. What's the best place to sell contraband? Uh, the den is really good. You can also go to the long mile. But I, I personally use the den. Um, the only thing I will say is be a little, you have to be a little careful with the den because there are some bugs associated with it. Although there was a hot fix today. Maybe they cleaned it up, but yeah. You could also do a uh, long mile and prima. Captain Collins, thanks for the raid, bud. Okay, let's do this. What are the bugs with the den? Um, If you That's try to enter the den and it says something about like, um, like a, you know, a, the, a, an unnamed location. It can also happen if you try to switch your ship, your active ship in the den. Then what happens is when you exit, you'll appear at New Atlantis and there'll be like holes in the world and a lot of missing stuff. And at that point, your game is kind of messed up and you have to load another game. So. Yeah, it's it's not pretty, unfortunately. Um... You know, I really just need to bite the bullet and do like a B upgrade or something. Maybe I should go buy that uh, narwhal. And we should build an upgrade around that. How much money do we have? Is, is the narwhal like, what, 5K? 500K? Oh, it's in Seoul. Where is this ship? Oh. Okay. Oh, Neil Winter. No, when I say load another game, I mean like an auto save before you docked with, with, uh, Den. Hey friend, don't mean to bother you, but I could really use some help here. Hey you, it is good to see someone out here. I've been drifting alone here for two days without help. I've got strict orders to destroy you. Well, shit. Hold on. Maybe we can make a deal. We've got something you might find interesting. And if that doesn't do it, we've got creds. All you have to do is come aboard. Okay. Yes, yes. Come aboard. Just don't try anything stupid. I'm sure you know how that will go. Crew made unlike visitors. Okay, that's far enough. Now you know I'm not as alone and helpless as you thought. So think about how you want to handle this. You've got two choices. We need ship parts to repair our busted craft drive. Hand them over along with your ship, and maybe we'll let you live. Or we dust you and take it anyway. You've got to the count of 20 before I make that choice for you. Everyone's just, why is everyone lying? Or a third choice, I kill you all and carry out the remainder of my mission. Death it is. With you vigilante type. Good talk. All right, message from Hearst. Interesting. Oh, we got options. I'm asking that you take care of the ship and anyone on board. I don't care how you do it. I just want to be rid of that this problem before someone catches on. If someone finds out I'm having an affair and the woman involved ran off with my government-issued ship, I'm sure that you'd understand that it would be very bad for me. I'd like to get ahead of that and just chalk it up to a simple theft and destruction. I repeat, the ship must be destroyed and we shall consider the terms of your payment null and void. He hired pirates. 
Oh my god, dude. Bro. Bro. I will take more than that. He hired pirates to cover up an affair and kill the woman he was having an affair with. Gun. <laughs> oh, but that's that never change. Actually, please change, but that was fun. Uh, okay. Take good stuff. Oh, nothing in the cargo hold. Ah, here we go. Beautiful. A balance. Oh, someone's down there that's got a mag. Oh, God. Oh, is that a silent an assassin's bill? Oh, it's not calibrated, though. Jerk. That's the guy with the mag. Advanced Threat Assault Spacesuit. Hmm. Man, that would be so terrible if something happened. Sorry, I had to. I did have the high ground, it's true. Find anything else in here? Um. Oh. Whoever finds this, my name is Sylvia Schloss. I've been drifting with no fuel for over a week with no signs of rescue. To all those I have wronged, I wish I could say I'm sorry, but truth is I don't know if that's true. This isn't how I would have liked to die, but the guilt and uncertainty have driven me to take my own life. Goodbye. Now, was that... I think that was planted? No, probably not, because the pirates were there to destroy the ship. So, no, probably not planted. That sucks, man. Whoa. Another mag pulse. Are you training for some sort of weightlifting competition? I swear to God, dude. So many empty weapons things. Ugh! Does the new patch completely reverse your initial review of the game? What? Why? Why would it? No, of course not. First of all, the only patch is a hotfix. And second of all, all the stuff they're adding is like stuff I would have liked to see in on release. Is it a great step forward? Absolutely, but even even if it changed how I felt about the game, it would never change my initial impressions of the game. So, yeah. No, not at all, actually. I will say that just yesterday, I was saying how it was very frustrating that Bethesda was not communicating with the community and letting us know their plans and stuff like that. So I will say I was very pleasantly surprised to see the tweet from Bethesda. Um, it looks like there's some great stuff coming down the pipeline. A lot of it that people requested. It looks like they are, they're apparently, you know, they're, they're saying the right things, which is great. And frankly, a lot better than being silent. So credit where it's due, that's awesome. And uh, and I am, I am thrilled to see this game 
frankly get the support that I feel like it deserves because, you know, I, I hope that we'll be, I hope that we'll be talking about this game similar to how I feel a lot of people talk about Cyberpunk these days, where it's like, yeah, it released in a pretty bad state, but the company stuck with it. And these days it's not the best game ever, but it's damn, it's in a lot better state than what it was in. And frankly, if they do that, I'll, that's, that's great. <laughs> we don't need the best game ever, man. I just, you know, I just, I just, I want to see companies stick with their product and make it the best thing it can be. So, yeah. That's where we are. Somebody said I missed a door. I'll make sure I didn't miss a door. No, I think we're good. Unless, oh, I think it was this you were probably thinking of. This door? Yeah, we're, that's, not a, that's not a door. It's an airlock. Madminot says, did it release in a bad state? This game? Yeah, I would say this game, this game released in a, again, the, the tagline for this game is it's the least buggy Bethesda game. And, and I would say that that's, that's not a great state. Could it have been a lot worse? Absolutely. Absolutely. It could have been a lot worse. And it is arguably the least buggy Bethesda game. Um, but there's no question in my opinion that it could have been released in a, in a lot better state. Yeah. Less bugs less weirdness. There are game breaking bugs in the, in it. A lot of QOL stuff that should have been, you know, more thoroughly addressed, especially when it comes to the inventory management and such. A lot of, lot of features that are just not really as fleshed out as they should be. That could have been a lot better. You know, there's, there's a lot, of, it could have, it could have been a lot better. To put it bluntly, it could have been a lot better. It's still a lot of fun and I'm still loving my playthrough, but you know, I'm one of the first to say it could have been a lot better. I am very cool to see that DLSS is coming, an FOV slider, uh, more color options. They say that they're going to start putting in QOL adjustments and stuff. So, I mean, there's there's a lot of really, really good stuff coming down the pipeline. All right, let's take a look at this quest and see exactly what our options are. It looks like we've got a few. We can destroy Hearst's ship, which I don't think I want to. We can return to Hearst. Wait, I thought something popped up about, like, turning him in. No? I thought something popped up about, like, talking to a corporal or something. Oh, you do that later. Well, that was the finding evidence thing. Okay, okay. So I can go talk to Hearst and then possibly turn him in. Oh, check activities. Yo, look at that. That should, that should totally be in the quest thing. Um, show her note. Okay. Yeah, I'm going to, I think I'm going to do this. I think I'm going to do that. Let's do that. I don't know why that's under activities. That's weird. Okay. Is there a way to go inside? Speak to Percival. Oh, well, we got to go do that at some point. This puts us outside, right? Yeah. Hmm. The game is broken for me after the patch. Really? What's going on? Oh, no, no, no. DLSS, FOV, all that stuff. No, no, just, just to make it clear, that's not in the game currently. It is not in the game. Yeah. That's all That's all stuff they're, do, they're going to do. Also, they're gonna add a push to instantly eat button. I am going to get so fat. So fat. Yep. Dizzy Doc says, Bethesda's lying in the patch notes saying they added an FOV slider. No, Bethesda's not lying. Uh, you are not reading, which is a very different thing. Yeah, it is. that is coming in a later patch. They only did a hot fix this time. Yeah. Two, two separate issues. One you can address. Yeah. <clears throat> All right, let's go over here. Hey, to be fair, I identify with that guy. Reading's hard. I know we're supposed to clean up then. I'm one of the first to say it. Reading reading is hard. I can't even read myself. Alright, so I'm gonna do a hard save before we do this, because this might be terrible. Welcome to Sedonia Security. Hi. I'm Commander Vincent Woodard, Chief of Planetary Security and former head of the Red Devils program here on Mars. Oh. 
I tend to deal with security at a high governmental level, whereas my associate Booth over there handles day-to-day -day security issues. So if you're looking to report a minor crime or misdemeanor, see him. But if there's something I can help you with, feel free to ask. Okay. Ah, okay, one sec. Cat got your tongue? Mm. And yes, a cat, a cat does have my tongue as I needed to reply to something immediately. Um, the fate of the world is at stake. Uh, okay, so what can you tell Let's Let's talk to this guy a little bit first. What can you tell me about this city? It's small, it's dusty, it's old, but it's home. Air? It may not be anything fancy, but I couldn't dream of living anywhere else. Bro was reading the rewards for each outcome. Delight? No, no. I, I was responding to a Twitter DM about a meeting that I probably missed. <laughs> it's a little late. Yeah. Scheduling. It's uh not something I'm super great at. Yeah. You seem like a military guy. Did you serve? Well, he just said he led the Red Devils, but... Still do, technically. Oh. I'm a naval commander but they've got me here pushing pencils ever since the Red Devils disbanded. I pull double duty, aiding in recruitment and serving as the Sidonia security chief, representing the UC. Maybe there's a chance for me to relive the glory days now that the Red Devil program has been reinstated. Hmm. Got any more to say? Uh, hmm. what, what, let's do, what do you think about the Terramorph Management Division? Time will tell. They're using the Red Devil's HQ, and many of the same people are involved. I can see why some people are saying the Red Devils are back, but that's not the whole story. The new initiative's in its infancy, and while the goal is different than the old Red Devil program, I'm optimistic. I'm ready to see how this plays out. It's with some certain comfort that I know the best and brightest minds are tasked with finding and eliminating the Terramorph threat. I like it. All right, Governor Hurst has been involved in criminal activities. That's a pretty serious accusation. I assume you have proof of these alleged illicit activities? I have a note sent to known pirates which detail his crimes. Hmm. Let me take a look at that. Well, this doesn't look good for Hurst. I'll say that. You did the right thing by coming to me. I'll take it from here. The United Colonies thanks you for your vigilance. First was supposed to give me a package for Peter Brennan. Can you help me out with that? Tell you what, I'll do you a favor. Go ahead and finish whatever deal you had with Hearst. Perfect. I'll wait what a bro. Oh, I like this guy. That. Just don't let him know we spoke about this. I don't want him running. And you don't want to lose whatever leverage you've got with him. That d man, thank you. Okay. Um, fantastic. I can tell you, Sidoni appreciates it. that here oh wait actually let's sell to him over here i love this hey, guy too you looking for it? take your time and ask me if you need anything i'm here to help thanks bud cool that's what we do here okay let's see the first time i find a calibrated 
Beowulf. It's going to be a good day, chat. It's going to be a good day. I keep finding calibrating drum beats, which are awesome weapons. I think that stuff starts dropping around 30, right? I think 30 is the magic level for the calibrated refined... Calibrated... No. Calibrated advanced. That's when we start seeing that stuff. Oh my god. Under credit, one. One credit. Yo, stay good out there. Chad is co-cheating on us with another keyboard? I am. I have two keyboards in front of me, to be fair. Oh, I need more ammo. That's true. Thank you. Also, I should start buying uh, resources and stuff that I need as well. Start stockpiling that on my ship. Mm-hmm. For ammo, I need the... Case of shotgun. Um, resources too. Nice. And it's gone. Okay. Oh wait. Just a reminder. Never seen a superior prefixed item ever. Yeah, so the, the, the rumor is that superior quality level weapons are bugged and not dropping because you can get superior quality armor, which is a new tier mathematically. So we're, people are trying to nail down exactly what's going on. May does not exist. I hope you've taken care of our little uh, problem. All right, save. It's good to see you. I'm eager to conclude our business together. I'm back. Now let's talk about your end of the deal. Did you uh, take care of my little problem? Your secret's safe. Good. I'll release Mr. Brennan's shipment to you as promised. I'll even defer his taxes as a little bonus. You really helped me out of this bind. Don't take this the wrong way, but... I hope I'm never in need of your help like this again. Oh, dude. Really? I can't wait. I haven't seen a single hard target yet. I'm kind of surprised. The Like, the only real sniper rifle in the game doesn't even show up until you're level 30. It's amazing how smoothly our mining operations run with me in charge. I can't recall the last time we've had any major issues. My shipment. Do you have it yet? Um. Here you go. Ah, yes. I'll take that. Now, um, I've probably got some important messages I need you to take care of for me while I, uh, um, attend to some other important matters at hand. You'll need my password. Remember. If you reply to anything, try to mimic my style and speech patterns. You know, for consistency. Okay. Approve the oh. equipment request. You're done? Meeting request. Okay. Okay. An outstanding tax balance, Glenn Hurst. Hello, loser. Since I learned that you don't even check your work computer for actual work purposes, I realized I can say anything I want here, and you'll never know. Blarg, boogity boogity boo. See, I can just say nonsense if I want. It doesn't matter. But here's some real truth for you. You've got a BO problem. You're lazy and incompetent. You're an entitled trust fund kid who lucked into your position because of who you know. And not even that, it's because of who your required. daddy knows. Yet they can't fire you because it'd be bad for the company for some reason. What a joke. You never even learned my name. I was your assistant for three damn years. It's Tim. It's not even hard to say. It's three letters. Working for you made me so mad. I'm glad I quit. I bet you didn't even notice. Tim. Yeah. It's Tim. Okay. Press. PTO policy. 
Some of us include have been working here for 15 years, but we're still stuck with a standard 10 days off per calendar year. I'm grateful for the employment, but I've heard somebody's get 15. Approved! Drink selection. Different drink options in the break area. Approved! Uh, messages. You haven't been replying to your messages in a timely manner. I'm writing this request in hopes that you or your assistant, when you hire one, might see it and get on that. Approved! Basement mining equipment. Approved. Fantastic. Bureaucracy! All right, let's go. Speak with Trevor. All right. All in a day's work, chat. A reminder that bring your child to work day is not an officially sanctioned holiday and that it is not advised to allow children in a potentially dangerous work site. It's not Keep very easy, but it pays the bills. Out of harm's way. <gasps> Thank you from the Sedonia Department of Labor. Oh my god. I hope I didn't make a mistake by letting... I wonder what's taking Hank so long. I've managed to approve your request. Who's Hank? Okay. I saw. <laughs> Good work. See? I knew having someone on the inside like that would work out. I've already put it in order for the equipment. I was going to ask you to pick it up for me, but there's a problem. One of my guys, Hank Ferraro... Ah, that's Hank. I tried to tell him he'd be more useful sticking to his job here, but he insisted. and He was already on his way out before I could stop him. But it shouldn't be taking this long. Just a quick trip to Gagarin and back. I'm concerned. I could use some help with this. Hey, Co. How about you use that standing desk? Yes, sir. Mm. All right. Mm -hmm. No problem. What do you think happened? I don't know. Maybe he got hit. Ever find the heart of Mars? I did. Maybe he's out of fuel, drifting. Maybe he just stopped for chunks. Anyway, something's up, and it doesn't seem good. Thanks, Since Justice. You've proven yourself so skilled in so many ways. I was hoping to call on you for it. So, you in? I am totally in. Oh, thanks. This is a huge help. Sweet shirt. You'll be Thank happy you. to know I actually carved out some of the budget so I can pay you for all of your assistance. We don't currently have much information to go on. I'd suggest checking with Sidonia ship services over at the starport first. Got it. They'd be the last person I know that's seen Hank. It's all I've got without sending you all the way to Gagarin to retrace his steps. Good luck. Okay. Make it happen. This update has effectively made my game unplayable and I don't know what to do. It constantly crashes to desktop when loading a save file. Any save file. I'm sad. You know, you're not the first person I've seen say that. I don't really know what's going on. It seems it seems like there's more than a few problem that are, problems that are dealing with that. Do you have any mod? Okay, question, question. Do you have any mods installed? Oh, Tycho says the DLSS mod was causing that. That's a, that's been causing problems. Hmm. You do have mods installed. Hmm. Try if you're having issues with crashing. Try disabling any mods. Oh, actually, let's take a look here real quick. Okay, no problem. Did we get a level since we checked? I don't think so, actually, but... Just to double check. Yeah, nothing yet. We'll just see 29. Once we can do the 34, that's going to be like when I buckle down and we build this damn ship. At least we build our... I think we'll probably do a BC class again. Since I'm level restricted. Uh, I'm looking for information on Hank Ferraro. I was told he passed through here. Hmm. Let's see here. Hank. Hank. Know him by that name. Oh, wait. Here we go. Henry Ferraro. 
Hank's gotta be his nickname. <laughs> yeah, he's been through here. Took a ship and departed. Actually, it looks like he came back into Mars space recently, but he didn't land here at the spaceport. The ship diverted and landed outside a city of ways. Really? Did he say when he departed? Nothing out of the ordinary. Got a ship and left. Tried and failed to get a discount on fueling up. Mm, that's about it. Let me go back to Trevor with this, inf this information and get to the bottom of this. Yeah, something seems off about this. You're probably right that you need to work this out with your boss. Maybe some wires got crossed. Anyway, good luck and good day to you. Hmm. So weird.